So do you think cursive writing is important? Important enough to be in every Indiana school? One lawmaker thinks so. And after years of trying, she thinks she got it this time. 24 Hour News 8's David Williams joining us now to explain. David. One question for you. How is your cursive writing? Well, you can see mine isn't the best, but State Senator Jean Lysing says this could help your child when they become an adult. I use it every day when I write checks and I write letters and uh, sign my name on things. Mrs. Amy Sue Bacon teaches cursive to her third graders at St. Richard's Episcopal School in Indianapolis. It allows us some time that's very self reflective when we're working on our cursive and looking at ways that we can improve our process. She says cursive writing and working on handwriting can stimulate brain activity and cognitive development. She believes her students will use the skills they're learning today as adults. So it's not only like a life skill, it's something that's quite enjoyable and can be very kind of centering when, uh, when you learn how to do that. That's part of the reason State Senator Jean Lysing is creating legislation right now mandating cursive handwriting be taught in Indiana schools. She co-authored a bill requiring a Department of Education survey that recently found some 70% of educators support it. I think that, you know, suddenly we're going to have legislators saying, oh, what's going on? Why did we quit teaching cursive? For the last six years, she's tried to get a bill passed, each time falling flat in the House. This time, she feels like it'll stick. What happens is our education chairman in the House apparently doesn't think it's necessary, so he doesn't give it a hearing. I think that if it were given uh, the opportunity for a floor vote, that it would pass. Eight-year-old Soren Hembry says he likes learning and using cursive in class. Some people don't think cursive would be the best thing to do and that it's a waste of time, but it's actually very important, so it should at least be recommended. Mrs. Bacon says she'll keep teaching and using cursive. I know it's beneficial in my class, and so I, could, I think it could be beneficial for all classes. So Lysing says she plans on filing this legislation early next year. 